Dr. T. And I'm Dr. J. Cheers! We're going to do a coffee chat today. Uh, we're going to talk about the healthy snacks, well, excuse me, not snacks, but healthy breakfast options. We get a lot of questions in the office on just healthier options. So let's start off with a staple, eggs. So we love this brand. You can find this uh, locally at Harris Teeter, Lowe's. This is Carol's brand. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's as well. Um, what you want to look for when you're looking for eggs, there's many options out there. There's cage free, um, what else? Uh, pasture free, raised. Pa free range and pasture raised is the best thing you're looking for. So when you, when you look for eggs, you want to look for the words pasture raised. Mm -hmm. And then what we like to cook the eggs in is butter. And when you look for butter, uh, one of the best brands that's uh, carried in all the grocery stores is Kerrygold. Uh, the reason we like this is because in small print up here it says milk from grass-fed cows. Yep. So that's what you're looking for with that. Um, another thing that you guys can do if you like oats, so there's a new overnight package um, at Trader Joe's. So it's already pre-made for you, but it does have a lot of sugar in it. So just make sure you're flipping over the label to read that and look at that. So if you want to create your own, it is super, super simple to do your own overnight overnight oats, um, which I've done before. So I get um, Bob's Red Mill organic oats, mm -hmm. uh, rolled oats, and you actually would take like a cup of oats, soak it in some milk. I use almond milk, or you could use regular milk if you'd like, uh, and you sit it in the fridge overnight and they will become like soft and they will plump up. Uh, and then to that, I also add berries. Um, so some nice healthy antioxidants in there as well. Uh, so super simple breakfast um, that you wouldn't even have to think about. Yeah, you like to add berries to your breakfast because uh, berries over every other fruit is lowering glycemic index. So you can eat berries any time of the day. Something like a banana uh, is higher in sugar. You usually want to eat that more in the morning time. Something that goes well with eggs, we love uh, sauerkraut. Sauerkraut is a great way to start your day. It's full of probiotics tons of healthy trillions of probiotics um, and the brand that we like uh, sauerkraut and pickles is Bubby's brand. Um, I usually find Bubby's at Whole Foods. Anywhere else you know? I think Harris Teeter even has it. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Uh, and then also another thing that you can do with berries is just yogurt or kefir which is going to be really good for your digestive system. Again full of probiotics. Um, Marissa was even saying that she does a little bit of kefir if she ever has a belly ache and it really helps go away. So. Kefir and berries. And if breakfast is hard to get away from, like cereals, um, if you're trying to get away from pancakes, we found this uh, Birch Blenders is a healthier pancake option. It's actually sugar-free, uh, sorry, low glycemic index, dairy-free. It's made with almonds, coconut, cassava flour, eggs, and monk fruit. Monk fruit is what makes it sweeter. So it actually doesn't have tons of sugar. All you do is mix this with water and fry it up in the pan and oh my gosh, they're so awesome. Good. They're so, so good. good. Um, yeah. We've been doing that. And then, talk about your chia, chia seed. Yes, yeah, so another thing you can do, add to your yogurt. Um, I love to do this, I love to add these to yogurt, is hemp seeds and chia seeds. Yeah. Both of these are packed full of protein and also healthy ALAs, healthy fats. Yeah. So if you have a breakfast on the go, grab some yogurt and berries and add these for a little crunch. Um, and these are both found at Trader Joe's. Let's talk about coffee, because coffee is probably mm -hmm. some of our team's favorite yes. beverage in the morning, for sure. So, um, their Maker Coffee, uh, this can be ordered online. Uh, we usually go through Instagram, through the Cageless Birds. Uh, that's what their handle is as well. Um, and we love their coffee, it is organic. If you're drinking coffee, try your best to find organic coffee. Yeah. Um, and then, what do we add into it? Uh, I use half and half. Um, so half and half uh, without sugar for me is just that creamy taste that makes the coffee taste good. Um, but I've learned to wean myself off of the flavored, really sugary creamers uh, and just use a little bit of half and half in it. Um, again, more good healthy fats for the day can help satiate you, keep you full a little bit longer. And the last things we have are just healthy options for tea. Traditional Medicinals is a brand that we like here. Throat coat's great if you have a sore throat or if you're sick. Um, this one, Puka, P-U-K-K-A, this is also a good brand of tea that's organic and fair trade. Uh, and then the last thing we have out here is our, our protein powder, great for making smoothies in the morning for breakfast on the go. Thanks for tuning in with us. See you next time on our Coffee Chat. Cheers. Cheers.